Hello there everyone, Ash and Flash here and welcome on into another Summer 2020 Sets video. Today we are going to be looking at the three LEGO Creator Sets that is going to be releasing in the summer. And starting things off, let's take a look at the first set, which is set number 31107, the Space Rover Explorer. And this comes with 510 pieces and will retail at $49.99 USD or $59.99 Canadian. And it's not my kind of thing. I don't really have an interest in any of the three builds. And I'm sorry for the crummy images, but uh, it's the best that we've got right now. And this is from a Portuguese retail site linked in the description. But honestly, it's just not my kind of thing. It's got one minifigure, which is typical for creator sets, but the alien build is interesting and the sort of space thing, I, I don't know, but the other two builds aren't something that I would pay money for, but I don't know, it's an interesting concept, but not really my thing. Next up, we've got set number 31108, the Caravan Excursion for 766 pieces. It'll retail for $79.99 USD or $89 or $99.99 Canadian. And this to me just looks like something out of city, but it's not. It looks quite interesting. I think uh, the designs of the two, like the car and the caravan itself is really interesting because it's almost like it's minifigure scale. So that's really strange. Like that car is big enough to put all three figures. So it's very strange that it's not the regular sort of scale for minifigures, but it's this real life size. I don't know. That's really intriguing to me. And then if you wanted to as well, one of the other builds is an RV, but it looks like significantly you're losing like a lot of bricks. But the one three and one that I really love is the lighthouse. I think that looks like a fun side build there. And it's an interesting use for the tires there that you can barely make out. But in general, I think the lighthouse looks really interesting. Lastly, we have set number 31109, and it is the Pirate Ship. It comes with 1,260 pieces and will retail for $99.99 USD or $119.99 Canadian. And it's really interesting that we're getting another Pirate Ship this year. And uh, I don't know, it's very weird. I, I honestly think that all three of these builds are really great. I'm honestly thinking about picking this up. I did a 3-in-1 review and it was pretty painful because it's just hard to build three sets three different ways. It's not really my thing, so I don't know. This is interesting. It's a brick-built sale as opposed to like the fabric ones from Pirate Bay. But honestly, I really love the other two designs. I like the like pirate cove or den or whatever that is i think that would kind of look well maybe next to pirate bay i'm not too sure but also i really love the skull island that is such a cool other like unique different build i think that looks so cool as well the way that the skull looks but then the ship itself it's also really nice i just don't think it's as nice as necessarily the barracuda bay one but i still am really thinking about picking this up but i don't know the price might be a lot but three minifigures and you getting you're getting a lot here you really are and honestly i like all the different designs of like the skull on the sail and even in the island i think it looks really cool but anyways everyone i'm a little bit disappointed not really in the sets because I'm not really too big a creator fan. I really only get the modulars and the occasional like roller coaster. That's the only thing that I'm a little bit disappointed about is that we don't have anything here. Maybe they're saving it for a January set, but a little disappointed that we don't have another roller coaster or something like that. But anyways, everyone, I hope that you did enjoy this video. Let me know down below in the comment section what you think of it. Make sure that you subscribe and turn on the bell notification so that you don't miss out on the latest Lego news. But I hope that you did enjoy it and I hope that you all have a great day. I'll see you all in the next one.